Happy birthday, Andy. Happy birthday, Andy. Hey, yo, happy birthday, Andy. Yo, try not to go too wild. We're not as young as we used to be, you feel me? Enjoy it, though, girl. Happy birthday, Andy. Andy, just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. I know that the world's gone to shit, but hopefully you can still celebrate your birthday. Happy birthday, Andy. Hope you have an amazing one. Hey, twin. Happy birthday. And guess what? I purposely ducked this up for you. Next is four. Surprise this to one fan. Happy birthday, Andy. Be well, do good. Take care, man. Happy birthday, Andy. Hey, happy birthday, Andy. Hope you're doing okay and staying safe. I uh, wish we could celebrate with you, but obviously with all the craziness, you know, we'll have to wait for another time. But hope you're doing well. I uh, hope 28 treats you well and starts off with a bang. So, you know, happy birthday to you. Happy 28th, Andy. Hey. <laughs> hey, Andy. I just wanted to wish you a happy birthday, turning the big 2-8. Congratulations, and just wanted to wish you the best. Happy birthday, Andy. I hope you have a fun time celebrating it. Um, please be safe. Don't die. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm really grateful that you came into my sister's life. Um, I'm also grateful that you came into mine and my brother's life, and I guess you're pretty cool. But <laughs> happy birthday. Happy birthday! What's up, Andy? Andrew here, wishing you a happy birthday. I hope you're feeling cozy in your Airbnb in Maine right now. Much like everyone else before me, we hope you enjoy your special day of the year as shown in the compilation you just watched. However, that's not all. We're about to go a little deeper and examine your present as well as your past. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy this special video dedicated to you. To this day, still, is the funniest slash best poop I've ever had with another person in my entire life. It was in the bathroom stalls of Mohegan Sun or Foxwoods or wherever. I don't remember that, Andy, where we were just dying in the bathroom. And so I just wanted to bring that up because still to this day, the funny, one of the, the funniest bathroom breaks I've ever had in my whole life. That one's a hard one, but I think I'll choose the time we went to Florida together. It was his first time and I wanted to take him to my favorite place ever, Disney World. Well, before I even get to the favorite memory, I have to bring up the first time we met. I remember we were at a park and I was playing with my middle school friends and Andy and his friends, they roll up in their you know, bike gang with their little bicycles. And I remember um, going over and saying hi to them. And then I see Andy there and he has this smug face. It's this mean mugging me the whole time. And that's when I thought, yeah, this dude's an asshole. And when I was looking at just old photos of the times that we spent together, I was surprised at how many adventures we had and so many pictures together, whether it was at Breakheart and we would be walking through the dark together with our couch formation and cooking weenies over a fire or whether it was at McDonald's at 4 a.m. and you ordered a, si a large fries with a side of medium fries and that just took me like I would just so that's so funny. You know how during the roller coasters on the big drops they would take a picture of you? Well he might kill me for showing you this, but um, they're hilarious. But my favorite memory has to be the time where we made videos together throughout high school. Um, all the sea walk videos, the lip sync videos, the end of the year vlogs, um, they were always fun. And uh, although we don't make them uh, anymore, uh, it's always my favorite memory of how our friendship really grew to what it is today.
Yeah, I still cringe whenever I watch those videos today. My favorite character of Andy's is how much of a celebratory guy he is. And what I mean by that is how he loves to get together with all of his friends and family, have a good time, and make memories. <sighs> Andy, I mean, the partier and raver. Uh, there's always three words that I associate with this guy at any party or rave. And it's one more shot. And I feel like we all need someone like that in our lives. And I'm so grateful to have him be that person. Because I feel like sometimes I can be a bit of a grandma. And he reminds me that we need to have fun every now and then. As time has gone on, I've definitely adjusted and know when to say no. But in the early days, I this, he was a good buddy of mine, so I wasn't going to say no to his request. And just, I can't count the number of times I've gotten in trouble because of this guy. Um, but, I mean, looking back at it, I don't regret it one bit. It's because he is a guy that just, he's the life of the party. So, um, anytime he offers you a shot, it's just because, you know, he's being very hospitable and trying to make sure everyone has fun. And, I sure would not have as much fun if it wasn't for him being there and uh, I'm really happy that he is that kind of guy and the partier and raver in him is something that I will never forget and it's something that I always attach to Andy. Andy overall is just a great person. Uh, our friendship has lasted, say, I think 13 years up until this point. It's, it's been a quick 13 years, really. Uh, as I mentioned before, how uh, we, we didn't start on the best of terms, but um, look where we are now. And the best way I can put it is that our friendship has really stayed consistent this entire time. Uh, there were times within our 13 years together where uh, we didn't see each other quite a bit. And um, despite that, the moment we reconnected again, it's as if Time didn't even pass. When I think about our friendship and our relationship over the years, I just think of you as that that person you could lean on, the, the funny, goofy, reliable person I would just love to hang out with. It's how caring and patient he is. He really knows how to make you feel welcomed and that he will always be there for you and that you have his full support. Even when he doesn't entirely understand, he makes it known that he will always be in your corner. And I'm grateful to have him there. Uh, and the thing about Andy is that he gives this great balance between fun and serious. Um, I always tell people that with so many aspects in life, it's always good to have a balance of things and not too much of one thing. And Andy offers that where I mentioned before, he's a party and raver. You know, he knows how to let loose and have fun and just live life. But at the same time, whenever uh, there's a problem that's presented or um, you need to talk about something, he's there for you. And uh, he's willing to offer advice. So having that balance within one person is so important. And uh, Andy really embodies that. And that's really, truly how I feel, why he's such a great person. Even though we've been friends for so long and then we you went to college for four years and we didn't see each other for such a long time I think our friendship remained the same if not got stronger after that and so I'm really thankful to have you as a friend and I know we'll have many more adventures together in the years to come so happy birthday so happy birthday Andy I hope you have a fantastic 28th birthday and many more birthdays to come Happy birthday, Andy. I love you.
keep it